Hey guys, in this video we're in chapter 4 on exponential and logarithmic functions and we're in section 7 on exponential and logarithmic models. And we're doing problem 32 which says a tumor is injected with 0.5 grams of iodine-125 which has a decay rate of 1.15% per day. To the ne nearest day, how long will it take for half of the iodine to decay? Now if you look in your book on page 403 um, you get an equation for what's called the half-life. So we have t half equals negative natural log of 2 divided by k, where k is going to be our decay rate. Um, and we have to make sure that this is actually as a decimal. So the problem gives it to us as a percent, so we're going to convert that 1.15 percent to a decimal, which is going to be 0.0115. One five. So that's going to be our k. So now all we have to do is plug it into our equation here, and we'll get that the half-life, um, the time it will take for half of the iodine to decay, will be the negative natural log of 2 divided by 0 0.0115. And the k, since the decay rate, is going to be negative, which will give us a positive here. And when we plug that into our calculators, we will get um, 60.27. Um, we we're looking for to the nearest day, so we'll say that t half, the time it takes for half of the iodine to decay, um, to the nearest day is going to be 60 days. And that's our answer. I hope you found this video really helpful. Uh, the concepts we covered in this video are true no matter what pre-calculus class you take, and the examples I cover are from this textbook right here. And remember, if you're a Baylor student currently enrolled, there is free tutoring on the first floor of Sidrich. You can create a one-on-one -on -one appointment online or drop in anytime during our business hours. Please visit our website, www.baylor.edu tutoring, for more details. Sick and bears.